in my business. And have you ever been told that you can't do something? Well, I have. Oh, let me tell you the story. A lady came into our classroom and she said that we were going to be talking about careers. She said, raise your hand and tell me what career you want to get. What career you want to do when you grow up? And I said, I wanted to continue being a speaker, author, and business owner. And she said, that is not a career. And I said, yes it is. And she said, no it's not. And I'm not going to argue with you. Since then, I've spoken at over 25 speaking events this year. And I won $25,000 at speaking at a pitching event. And I got to host a TV show on Fox 5, and I have met several millionaires and billionaires. Have you ever been to Chick-fil-A? Well, guess what? I met the CEO of Chick-fil-A. Here's a picture of me and him together and then at an event, and he, and he bought all of my products at that event, and I'm hoping he puts them in the kids' mail. And that's another picture of me when I was on when I was on a TV show, Fox 5, Atlanta's Best New Home. I've been featured on Fox 5, TV Asia, and NBC. I started my company in 2018 because I would ask my dad and I would say, Daddy, did you know? And I would tell him things that he didn't know or didn't know. And he encouraged me to start a YouTube channel, which later led to me creating my financial product, my financial flashcards, activity books, courses, and other financial products. And I began educating myself more through the Black Business School, J. Morrison Academy, and the Generational Wealth Academy. Here are some other pretty cool people I met. Damon John from Shark Tank, Jay Morrison, a real estate mogul, and Steve Harvey's wife. <coughs> Here are some ways you can earn money instead of asking money. Instead of asking your instead of asking for money. Ask your parents, neighbors, and people you know, how can you earn money? You can rake leaves, take the trash to the street. We clean extra chores. Well, I work in our family business where I would take the trash out. And you can also make slime, lemonade, cookies, soap, all sorts of things. And you can sell your product at a flea market or at a vending setup. Save your money. After you have our money, save about $100. Ask your parents to start a guardianship account. Christmas is coming up soon, so don't spend your Christmas money because you're already getting gifts. And you and know what you're budgeting for. Always plan to make more money than the item or activity. Like if you were buying a video game that costs $20, you would budget for $30 and keep the, and keep the $10 in extra. And I have a kid that teaches what a family budget is. We are going to play a budgeting game today, and I have a prize for the winning team. Success doesn't come without challenges either. I was in speech therapy since I was three years old. Now I get paid for speaking. And also, being told that you can't do something because you're a kid. A man told me that I couldn't be a I couldn't own a property because I'm a kid and I'm going to prove him wrong. Daddy, did you know, solve the problem to financial literacy through my financial flashcards, activity books, and my book title. I'm not going to argue with you. And here I was at a photo shoot where I would, where I was put in a magazine. And to learn how to budget, save, and invest and profit your money, join my Young Leaders Financial Academy. You can contact me at my website, daddydidyouknow.com, Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube, all at Daddy Did You Know. Now let's play a game. There will be two teams. Each team will 
choose products on the table to complete a full lunch. Drink, main item, and snack. The team with the most money left after. You add up the cost of the item for the lunch. Win the prize. <laughs> the team with the most money left after. Yes. <laughs>